Quite spectacular. And volcanic. <laughs> that too. My team has been researching seismic activity here. It'll be good to see them again. Oh. Ooh. Hang on, everybody. Nothing to worry about, Sequoia. Just a little turbulence. Your mom has it under control. Oh. Oh. <laughs> See? Under control. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. Atka Island, do you read me? Read you loud and clear, Layla. I'm feeling some bumps up here, Tatiana. What's the situation? Glad you radioed. There's a low-pressure weather system moving in from the south. Looks pretty stormy. Roger that. I think I better land while the landing is good. What about the volcano? Doesn't look like we'll be visiting a volcano today, Molly. Oh. <sighs> okay. Sorry about that, Segoya. We have to accept what life brings us. Mm hmm. <gasps> ah. Layla, you made it! Couldn't have done it without you. Molly, meet my friend Tatiana. She's the airport manager on Atka Island. Also, the postmaster, the yoga instructor, and the kindergarten teacher. Hi! Molly, I haven't seen you since you were a baby. And Nat, welcome back to Atka Island. Thanks. Good to see you again, Tatiana. And who is this? It can't be. Yep, another girl growing like a weed. Molly, meet my daughter, Nadia. Oh, hello. Oh. Tatiana, I should really send an email to my team to let them know I've been delayed. Of course, Nat. You can use the computer in my office. Nadia, can you show Molly around? Her mom and I have lots of catching up to do. Sure. Come on, Molly. What's going on? Practice. We're getting ready for the gathering tonight. And I'm doing the seal dance. The seal dance? What's that? I'll show you. Can I try? Sure, just do what I do. So first you do this, then you do this, and then you bob like a, whoa! <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> gotcha. Uh, sorry, Molly. I just can't get this part right. <sighs> I'm supposed to bob up and down like a seal in the ocean, but it's not easy. Is it a traditional dance? Yes. Our people created it when they brought our dancing back. It was inspired by our ancestors' dances. What do you mean? Well, during World War II, our people were forced to leave our village. Really? It was a very hard time for us. We stopped dancing for many years. Later, some of our elders remembered parts of our dances, but 
other parts were forgotten. That's really sad, Nadia. Yes. But now we're bringing the dances back. But how can you bring them back if they were forgotten? I'll show you. These are all historical artifacts. Things you might find in a museum. They're about our people. The Unanga. Are those people dancing? Uh-huh. When we were trying to figure out the ancient dances, we looked for clues in old pictures and drawings. What language is that? Russian. It's the journal of an explorer who came here in the 1700s. He wrote a lot about our dances. So we also used his descriptions to try and figure out how to do them. Ooh, and what are those? Oh yes, our ancestors made them a long, long time ago. Cool. Look closer. See, they're doing our dances. Really? Yep, that one's my favorite. <gasps> She's doing the seal dance. That's right. I love her so much, my mom made me this. So we can dance together. Like this. Ugh. Oh. But I just can't get the hang of it. And the dance is just a couple of hours away. You girls having fun? Hi, Grandpa. Nadia was just showing me her seal dance. I'm dancing tonight. Really? Oh, I'd like to see that. Me too. While I'm here, there are some seismographs I want to check out. You girls want to come with me? Yes! Maybe a little break from practicing is what you need. The ocean always makes me feel better. Me too. Molly, look! Whoa, the sand is black. That's because of the volcanoes. But look farther. In our language, a seal is isu. Oh, I see you've made some new friends. Uh-huh. Aren't they cute? Oh, look at them bobbing up and down. Storms come up fast here. Ooh, better make a run for the shack. <gasps> Nothing to worry about, Segoya. The power just went out, that's all. That happens sometimes. There should be some candles around. Aha! Uh -huh. Found one! Ah, there we are. We'll be fine in here until the rain stops. Ooh, look at this beauty. Just as old as I am, and still works great. <laughs> I hope the rain stops soon. I really have to practice for the dance tonight, and I still don't have it right. Can you practice here? Uh, I guess. Down and up, down and up. You look a little like the bobbing seals we just saw. It's hard to bob like you're in the water when you're really on land. Try it, Molly. Okay. Oh, wait a sec. There. My little dancer can inspire us. I'm ready to be a seal. Oh, uh, what do I do? So, do a little bow, then come up. Like this. Down and up. Down and up. Down and up. Huh, you two are getting the hang of it. Thanks but it's still not quite right. I feel so stiff. <gasps> Nadia, look! Her shadow is dancing! Like the seals! That's it! We need to move like the shadow! Down and up. up. Down and up. You're doing it, Nadia. Smooth as a seal. Yes, I finally got it. How do we look, Grandpa? Just like seals. <laughs> ah, there we go. Sounds like the rain has stopped. 
Time to head back. Kaha Sakuk, thank you for the dance seals. Nadia is going to make you very proud. Nadia, it's time to get ready for the dance. Did you figure it out? Yes! With a little help from Molly. And the seals. And the shadow. Grandpa said we could stay for the performance. What do you say? How could we miss it? Great! Well, come on, Nadia. You better get dressed. Mom, I need to ask you something. <sighs> Fantastic idea. Where's Molly? She'll miss the show. She's off with Nadia. Ooh, ooh, ooh. It's starting. Dances from Akka? Sure, my friends in Akka are practicing now. On, Molly! We are in Akka, Alaska, down on the Aleutian Islands. My ancestors have been living here forever, basically. Today we are going to practice Nangach dancing. Our dances relate to our ancestors and to our culture. If I was to look at how my culture has changed and how it's the same, I'd look in books, history books. We have a lot of history books here. We looked at a lot of books to see how our ancestors danced and to see what our ancestors wore. These are people dancing they're holding the drums sideways like we do sometimes. We learned that our ancestors wore very similar things that what we wore today in our dancing. This is a traditional Nungar hat. Our ancestors actually used to use this for hunting. And this is what we wear when we dance. The dancers themselves have changed, but they're very similar to what our ancestors did. Remember last fall when my cousin Randall sent me this video called Traffic Jam Sitka Style? It's nuts! Why are there so many seagulls? There's nowhere to dock. And then I sent one back called Traffic Jam Kaya Style? Well, Randall just sent me a new video. Want to check it out with us, Suki? I call this the Shifty Twisty Bitey. Here we go! Woo! 
snowboard in a week. Right? Oh. A shifty, twisty, bitey? Oh, man. Randall's got mad skills. Yeah, and that's why I need to borrow a snowboard, a helmet, goggles. Oh, and can you teach me some sweet tricks? Uh, sweet tricks? I gotta make a video that shows Randall how we snowboard Kaya style in one week. I'm a dog sledder. My brothers are snowboarders. I've done it exactly once. That's 100% more times than me. You'll be a great teacher. That makes sense. Unless I think about it. We'll practice a lot. Like an hour a day, all week. Then, video time. Come on. <sighs> this is going to be interesting. The important thing is balance. Wooly! Ah! Are you okay? I'm good. I've been learning this new dance. It's called the Whip Shake Slide. Check it out! Whip, shake, slide! <laughs> Pretty cool, huh? Sweet! Let me try. Whip, shake, slide! <laughs> uh, Molly? Remember you've got one week to learn snowboarding? Oh, right. Why do you have to learn how to snowboard in a week? I'm making a video for Randall. It's a long story. Wanna watch us? No, thanks. I gotta practice my whip shake slide. Good luck! Whip shake slide! Make me feel alive! You want to bend your knees a little. Got it? Got it. <laughs> Guess I lost it. We'll try it together. <laughs> Maybe we should try it on flat snow first. Yes! This works! I can totally balance when it's flat! I am the Snow Queen! Yeah! Huh? Uh, hey. Why'd I stop? Whoa! I have no idea! Now that's who you want for a snowboarding teacher. Hey! That was awesome! Thanks! But the name's not Hey. Auntie Midge? Much better. Wow, you've got great snowboard style. Thanks, Tui. I do like to shred it up. Could you give us a lesson or two? Or a hundred? Sure. Let's see. I have yoga on Thursday. Then I'm going to Anchorage. Hmm. I was two weeks from Tuesday. Oh, I don't have that long. Molly needs to make a video in a week. I told Randall I'd show him snowboarding. Kai style. Oh, yes. I saw the shifty, twisty, bitey, and snow too. Pretty sweet. My advice for you, don't tense up. Stay loose but strong. Nani tanaga a. See you again. Loose but strong. Huh, I could do that. Ugh. Whoa! Ugh. Huh. 
Uh-oh. Maybe not. <sighs> hey! You're getting pretty good on the flat part. Yeah, but it's been three days and I still can't jump or even go downhill without falling. Well, maybe you could make Randall a video without all that stuff? But then snowboarding Kaya style will be really boring. What even is Kaya style? I don't know, but I'm sure we'll figure it out. Hi, Mr. Rally. Hey, Molly. Hi, Julie. Why are you balancing pilot bread on your nose? Oh, yeah, <laughs> just trying to teach Brownie a new trick. <laughs> Not bad. Now that's Kaya style. Now you try it. <laughs> Wait, Dewey, that's it. You're gonna snowboard while balancing pilot bread on your nose? No. Maybe Kaya style doesn't have to be fancy. It's like Mr. Rally's trick. Just goofy and funny. Hmm. Goofy and funny. We're already pretty good at that. Then we're gonna need some ideas. To the library! Molly! Look! I've been practicing! Whip, shake, slap. Whip, shake, slap. Whip, shake, slide. Whip, shake, slide. <laughs> <laughs> Great moves. But I hate to tell you this, we're in a library, not a dance club. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Dad. Molly, look what I found. We might be able to find something goofy and funny in here. Great idea. Oh, and I think there's some winter sports magazines on the front desk. Let's check those out, too. Bye, Trini. See ya! Whip, shake, slap. Hmm, all these tricks look super hard. You find anything yet? Oh, no. And now we only have three days. Hey, what's this? Ski jewelry. Harness sled dogs pull skiers across the snow. <laughs> That's pretty funny. Hey, I think I found something too. Tandem snowboarding. Two snowboarders doing tricks together on a board built for two. Or tandem board. I love it. There's only one problem. We don't have a tandem snowboard. Hmm. <gasps> Wait. We do have a dog sled, right? How about one dog team, one snowboard, one sled? Two-person sled board jewelry. Pretty cool. But I feel like we're missing something. Yeah. Randall's trick had three elements. A shifty, a twisty, and a bitey. We need something else. It's Trini. I finally perfected the whip shake slide. Whip, shake, slide. Whip, shake, slide. Ah. Ready? Ready! Now! Whip, shake, slide. Whip, shake, slide. Whip, shake, slide. <laughs> Wow, that was amazing. Gotta hand it to you. You and your friends got major style. Not just major style, Kaya style. Whip, shake, slide. Whip, shake, slide. Yeah! yeah!
and Denali is made possible in part by a Ready to Learn grant from the U.S. Department of Education, the Corporation for Public Broadcasting, a private corporation funded by the American people, and by viewers like you. Thank you. Masi Cho! Watch your favorite shows anytime on the PBS Kids video app.